we are about to stay at the worst reviewed hotel in Indiana. Oh! What is that? I can't stay here. That is blood! I just heard somebody outside the door. What's up, YouTube? It's That's So Keezy, and I'm back again with another video. Just like I promised. What we're gonna do right now is we're gonna go in the room first, and we're gonna explore the room and see how bad it actually is. Room 316. Let's go in here. Ooh. Okay, so we had to get two double beds. They didn't have any king beds. So this this is what we were left with. From the looks of it so far, it looks okay. It looks okay, but it does have a weird odor. I'm not sure. Okay. I do want to go throughout the whole room and actually identify some of the things that I read in the reviews. Somebody got stuck on the elevator. The first thing I did when I got in here was I took the freaking stairs. I read that there was blood stains on the sheet, dirty clothes inside the room. And I also read that the shower was very dirty. Oh, oh, and someone said that there was actually human urine on the floor in their room and they had to request another room. So we're going to go through this room and we're going to find out if that is actually true. And if it is, I'm not staying here. I'm not staying here overnight. What? First things first, I feel the AC blasting. They must have known I was coming because I love to have the AC on 60 or 61. I, I love being cold in my room because I could just cuddle up and wrap up like a tamale in it. Ooh, yes, it's just everything. Secondly, we're right outside of a, what is this? A Sam's Club. Look at all this traffic. Uh, -uh I don't want to see all this while I'm trying to review my room. On first glance, the beds actually look okay. I'm gonna start with this bed. Whoa, 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 hold up, what is that? Is it wet? It looks wet. What? What? This is disgusting. Are the sheets stained or anything? That's what they said in the reviews. They are stained, look. Look at all that brown stuff, that gray stuff. No, no, man. Something is calling me to look inside this drawer. Oh, <laughs> wait, what is that? What is that? The paint is like chipping. I thought that was something like in the drawer, like blood or something. Everything does look very dated and old. Look at this. The floors seem to be... What is... Is that a roach? Okay, the floors seem to be kind of clean. I keep seeing a lot of stuff, so maybe the floors aren't that clean. We got a microwave, mini fridge. Look at this. Looking very old and dated. Mmm. It's not looking much different to me than any other budget hotel. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not seeing anything that's like crazy. Oh, somebody left a shirt and a hanger for a bra maybe. So that's one thing I can't debunk. Somebody actually left some clothes in the drawer. Do y'all not see that smoke coming out? What is that coming out of the AC? Oh my God, okay. Here's the sink, everything looks pretty clean with the sink. What? No, no. What is on that rag? Is that, is that what I think it is? No. No. Dirty linens? Everything in the reviews that I read is starting to come true. That, for me, that takes the cake. There's literal like poop on the rag. I don't know if that's actual poop on the rag, but something's on the rag. It doesn't look clean at all. I gotta send John into the bathroom because I'm, I'm concerned, okay? Hello. Look, look at it. Yeah, you yeah. see it? You see them dots this in This is it? blood, isn't it? Is that blood? I think so. Nothing else is colored that color. I didn't even see that. Oh my gosh. And what are all these white dots? The wall just looks so dirty. Look at that. Look at all this on, what is that? Is that blood? It might be. That's blood. And it's dirty there. That is blood. What the heck? Uh, How is it? Look what? At, oh my God. Ah! What is that? What is that? so nasty that is so nasty like that that's not even that's nothing to joke about that is so freaking disgusting For real, call, we'll call the health i'm out to go let the front desk know john's calling the front desk Man, to tell you her gotta come up here and see this room it is i can't i feel i'm feel like calling the health department we found uh crap in the shower a literal paper towel with poop on it is she coming up yeah, she's, she's super like apologetic and worried. This is nothing bad on her, y'all. I just want to say that because she was super, yeah. super nice. When we first checked in, I should have been filming. She sent us to a room and the room yeah. was completely messed up. Right. The beds were not made and we had to go to the room next door. Yeah. I just want to make that clear. It's, it's not the front desk lady's fault. But this hotel, I wish I could put them on blast because this, this is just not okay. Just wanted to give you guys an update. It's been about 35 minutes. We're still sitting here in the same spot in the room. No one has came upstairs yet. We're actually about to hop in the elevator now and 
and go downstairs and see what's going on. And now we're gonna go check out the elevator, which I'm so nervous about because I already hate freaking elevators. Like, this is my worst fear getting trapped in an elevator. Thank but... you. <laughs> I don't want you to protect me. I want you to break us out of here if we get stuck. Oh, well, I gotta go through the hatch. Up here. I am not going through that. Yeah. Up there? Yep. No. And there's stuff up there too. Can you can y'all see that? Y'all see that red stuff up there? Babe! Whoa. What was that? I don't know. No. No, 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 no. Okay, so we successfully made it back to the room. That was so intense what happened on the elevator. That's crazy. We did check for the front desk lady and she was not there. So what I'm assuming is she's busy, which is why she never came up to our room. I guess I'm gonna just have to let that go. They probably know how bad their hotel is. And so they don't even take any of this stuff serious because for them to put us in a dirty room in the first place, to me, that, that just shows they really don't know what's going on with the rooms. Guys, so it has been a few hours. We actually left and had to run some errands. And we also were thinking about, okay, if we don't wanna stay here, we need to find somewhere else to stay, right? So we took the dogs to a dog park. And while we were at the dog park, I researched other hotels that we could stay at. We cannot find anywhere to stay in um, Indianapolis. That's less than $200 a night. Plus you gotta pay $50 per pet. I'm not leaving my dogs in the truck. So I'm feeling like there's literally nothing we could do besides either Either sleep in the truck or sleep in this hotel room we're getting back into the dreaded hotel you guys i mean in the dreaded elevator i'm so nervous about this okay we're on our floor Whoa. is it stuck Whoa. oh my see no get out let's get out of here just a little update we're sitting on the beds, not laying on them just sitting on them and we're watching tv right now we're watching a little youtube i'm trying to just relax and just try to forget about everything that we saw earlier but i can't okay i can't all i'm thinking about is what we saw in the bathroom the dirty rag the rag on the bed and i'm just like how the heck am i gonna sleep in this bed i'm just so stressed i'm so stressed and i i don't know i don't know I, we just got done eating our dinner john has agreed to sleep in the bed that has stains on the sheets because he convinced himself that the sheets have been washed because he smelled them and they smell clean it's just stains i'm gonna sleep in the other bed because obviously we can't both fit in a double bed because your girl is a little fat all right guys so i'm in the bed right now john is already asleep I cannot sleep for anything. All I'm thinking about is bed bugs. I hope that I'm not gonna be up all night because we literally have to get up at 4 a.m. and it's already 10.30. Y'all, it's 2 a.m. and I swear I just heard somebody outside the door. I think someone just jiggled the freaking door handle. I know I heard it. Even the dogs are awake right now because they heard it too. Oh, I just dead ass heard it again. I swear. John, 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 get up. Someone is jiggling the door handle. Someone is jiggling the door handle. I, yes, yes, I'm, I'm so sure. I can't stay here, I can't stay here. Okay guys, we have everything and we're actually getting ready to get on the elevator and leave. I feel like it's not safe, it's filthy, it's dirty. I just can't do it, so we're leaving. No, why is it not working? So we had to take the stairs and look at this, you guys. John's trying to get out. I need to hold the door for him, but look at this. You, you can't even go down to the first floor, so how are we going to get out of here? 